the new A24 movie starring Joel Edgerton, him and his family out in the middle of the woods. One night, a guy breaks into his house and all hell basically breaks loose. First off, this movie is a slow burn. The marketing for this movie makes it look more like a horror type film and there's really not much scary about it except for the setting that they're in. Because it's like a post-apocalyptic, you really don't know what this thing is that's killing everyone. Like if it's an airborne virus or how it's spread or that. And that's probably the only horror part about this movie. The rest is more of a drama, a serious drama between these people and how they're dealing with the situation at hand. And for me, I really like that. That's one thing I loved about this movie. It takes its time really developing the suspense in this movie between the characters and it works to its advantage. This is pretty realistic what's happening to these people. By the end, when everything hits the fan, you're hurting with these characters. You feel the pain, you feel it just hurting your soul. But if you're expecting like a scary film that with jump scares on it, you're not getting that here. You're not. Acting from everyone in this movie is great. Even from the dog, I would say, is really good. <laughs> Joel Edgerton, he's the lead in this movie. He's actually really impressed me over the past few years, especially with The Gift and Midnight Special. Please watch The Gift. I'm talking to you, Mick. <laughs> you get scary Joel Edgerton. He's great in this movie. Everyone is. Director Trey Edward Schultz. He does a really good job building the tension in this movie. As well, the shots. This is more of an artsy film. Um, he actually previously worked on one other smaller independent movie, which from Rotten Tomatoes, he had 97%, so yeah, I might watch it, hopefully. But this is more of an artsy film, and it works for this movie better than, say, The Witch, which I know has some of its supporters, but I just thought it was okay. <laughs> is that Black Phillip? <laughs> this movie's not for everyone, and... It's a really dark, depressing film when you get down to it. There's no real ray of sunshine in this movie at all. It's all suspense throughout the entire movie. There's not even, I don't even think I laughed once in this movie. There's no laughter to ease the tension. I can see that not working for some. For me, it did. I would give this film an A. Hey, uh, where's Carl? He's supposed to do The Mummy. You know, he's supposed to review that movie? The one that neither of us wanted to go see? Hey, Carl. Hey, Carl. Carl! 